Welcome back. On this um, video, we're going to be showing a what you might think is an error, but it's not. It's the way how the models are built. Uh, on this particular uh, instance, we're going to be using this model, Vinny, from ImagineGrowth.com. Uh, let me show you what I mean. Grab the model. Drop it in here. All right, so let's say you wanna use this model as your base. And you go over here to the sliders and you see that it has um, some different outfits. Then this is what you're looking for, a full uh, base for um, for your own purposes. So you end up grabbing it and tossing it into uh, PMX. So you grab your mask and you start, let me just get rid of the bones so you can just see it better. And you start like, going through the list, uh, trying to turn off and only getting the uh, the body to show. Just go, go, go. Just, like... All right, so you got rid of every single thing. And okay, so these ones are called body. So you toggle that one on. Well, that one's not showing anything, so you go for the next one. And that one has a cut up version of the body. And that one, you don't see anything. That one, you're not seeing anything at all. Huh, so at this point, you're just like saying, like, oh, okay, so what's going on, right? Um, one thing you want to. Uh, a toggle let see this little um, vertex the green button right next to the bones and that one's gonna show you any of the uh, uh, vertex to see whether or not there's something hidden that you're not seeing as a texture so this is actually really helpful if they're like and you turn that off and there's nothing there right but you toggle that one on, it's like, oh, wait, so there, there is something there. I just can't quite see it. All right, so this means the uh, the alpha channel, the material is um, placed on transparency, uh, right, uh, the being. So let's toggle that off. So that's that. Here, here, here. So most likely we're going to want that one. It's going to be our full body. Oops. So how do we set this one to be uh, fully transparent? So you go over here to your um, material tab. So this one's going to be number nine. Go down, scroll to number nine. Here. And right here, you see the uh, opaque, it's set at zero. That means that um, at the beginning of the, uh, uh, like a boot up, this is not going to show unless you add a morph later on. That is going to, uh, let's see, it's probably one of these. Select number nine, so we can find number nine. Here, that one. So we go to edit. So this one's uh, place on to add. So if you move the slider all the way to the right or all the way to one, it's gonna be opaque to one. So it's going to appear. If we go over here to our transformation, let me cancel that. 
Uh, it's gonna be third one. Here we go. Let me turn off the bones. So you see the body fully appears and disappears. So that's what the little toggle is for. But let's say you want to uh, have this one to be uh, fully visible. So you change this uh, opacity to 1. And let's turn this off. And what right off the bat, there's your body. It's no longer opaque. It took the bean. So if you have this little problem, you need to go and uh, usually go to the whole entire list and make sure this is all they're all set to one. So go down, 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 down. So that one's uh, set to zero. So let's drop that to one. That's zero, one. Zero, one. One, one. Okay, zero. Let's do one. One, 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 one. And last two. All right, so now all the materials there are set to uh, be visible. Let's go back here and let's toggle everything on. So this is the reason why they turn those materials off. That way you won't have this uh, clipping effect. If you have uh, multiple pieces of clothing on your uh, model. You can either do it this way, means uh, having been disappeared, or do the opposite in your morphs where this one you're gonna have it to edit and pretty much just set it to zero and what ends up happening is you end up disappearing at a certain section instead of uh, being uh, visible All right, so that will be a simple way of how to fix your models from um, having parts of it that are not actually there or at least not visible and how to bring them back or how to do the opposite if you want to make them disappear you just toggle this one to uh, visible with one to invisible zero well then, I'll catch you guys later.